Delta State Governor Right Honorable Sharif Abarawari pledged to work with the military and other security agencies for the state security and socio-economic development. He praised the army for their professionalism and restraint during the Okwama 17 conflict and appreciated the withdrawal of soldiers from troubled communities. Abarawari also announced the certificate of occupancy C of O for the 56.35 hectares gifted to the amphibian battalion of the Nigerian army. We will continue to partner with the Nigerian army and other security agencies to ensure that we have peace in line with our more agenda which will enhance peace and security. This 25 hectares was gifted to the 90th amphibian battalion of the Nigerian army by the registered trustee of Iweriko and Amira in Koko. I appreciate you again for the role that people played. We don't do social media in security issues, but they don't, they don't understand what we did behind because we know what happened when it happened in Odi, when it happened in Zakubia. We know what happened. But we prayed and God answered our prayers. A Major General Jamal Abdul Salam thanked Governor Borowari and the Eweroko and Amerin Family Trust for providing land for army barracks in Koko. He praised Governor Borowari for his support and cooperation, praising his diplomacy and strategic role in resolving the Okwama incident. We have the three battalions in Mori, 90 amphibious battalion in Koko, and 181 battalion in uh, Ako. Uh, so, if you look around in the Nigerian army, it's not every brigade. There are very few brigades that have full complement of three infantry units. And this clearly shows the strategic importance that the Nigerian army has for Delta State. I want to solicit your Excellency's uh, assistance also to help us put some structures in our barracks here in Asaba. It has been there, it has been fenced. However, uh, our troops are just uh, scattered around. If we can have maybe internal roads and some one or two stru structures in that place, it will assist us greatly. The soldiers will be able to move their families if they have accommodation here, and that will make them settle and now work properly with uh, one mind and uh, with ease. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.